the countdown to Betelgeuse's supernova may have already begun. This massive star, located in the Orion constellation, has been one of the most studied stars in the sky, and recent observations have given astronomers a glimpse into its unstable future. Betelgeuse, a red supergiant, has been fluctuating in brightness, with periodic dimming and changes in its appearance that suggest it is nearing the end of its life. Scientists have been closely monitoring these fluctuations, and while the exact timing of its eventual explosion remains uncertain, some believe we might be closer than ever to witnessing this dramatic event. Some even think it could occur within our lifetime, an event that would provide groundbreaking insights into the death of massive stars. What makes Betelgeuse even more fascinating is the ongoing mystery surrounding its behavior. For years, astronomers believed that Betelgeuse, like most massive stars, was a solitary star slowly dying. It had been a typical red supergiant star, burning through its hydrogen and helium fuel and slowly swelling to an enormous size. But recent findings have upended that assumption. There's evidence that Betelgeuse might not be a solitary star after all. In fact, it could be part of a binary system with a companion star influencing its behavior in unexpected ways. Some of Betelgeuse's more unusual characteristics, such as its erratic dimming and rapid rotation. Some astronomers suggest that the companion star could have played a crucial role in accelerating Betelgeuse's aging process, possibly contributing to the unusual fluctuations we are seeing. Using powerful telescopes like ALMA, Atacama Large Millimeter Dike Submillimeter Array, Astronomers have found evidence of what is called stellar cannibalism. This occurs when a star absorbs material from a companion star, drawing mass from its partner. This interaction could explain Betelgeuse's erratic behavior and rapid rotation. As Betelgeuse cannibalizes its companion, the material it absorbs could affect its internal processes and lead to the observed dimming and fluctuations in brightness. Some researchers suggest that this could be a precursor to the star's impending collapse, as the sudden influx of material could destabilize Betelgeuse, pushing it closer to a supernova. A supernova is one of the most violent events in the universe. When a massive star dies, it undergoes a rapid collapse, creating an explosion so powerful that it releases a burst of energy visible across vast distances. In the case of Betelgeuse, when it eventually explodes, the amount of energy released would be immense, scattering elements like iron, carbon, and oxygen into the surrounding space. These elements are vital for the formation of new stars, planets, and even life itself. Without supernovae, these building blocks of life would not be created, and the universe would look very different. The explosion of a supernova not only marks the end of a star's life, but also contributes to the ongoing process of cosmic evolution. The elements dispersed during a supernova explosion are recycled into the next generation of stars and planets, making supernovae crucial for the ongoing development of the cosmos. Supernovae are not just spectacular events. They serve as important tools for understanding the universe. By studying the remnants of a supernova, scientists can track the conditions of the star before it exploded providing valuable insights into the evolution of galaxies and stellar populations. Supernovae are also used to measure the size and age of galaxies, helping astronomers better understand the history of the universe itself. They allow us to glimpse the future of stars, including our own sun, and predict when other stars might go supernova. However, predicting when Betelgeuse will go supernova remains a challenge. The star's fluctuations in brightness are not fully understood, and the recent discoveries surrounding its companion star and the surrounding cosmic environment add even more complexity to the situation. One of the key unknowns is the role of the gas clouds that have been found around Betelgeuse. These clouds could be affecting the star's behavior, but it's unclear whether they are part of a temporary phenomenon or if they represent a more permanent change in the star's structure. In addition, Betelgeuse resides within a hot bubble in space, a dynamic and active region that could be influencing the star's life cycle in ways that we don't yet fully understand. Could the hot bubble be accelerating Betelgeuse's death 
or is it simply a part of the normal process of stellar evolution? These questions remain unanswered, and each new observation only adds to the mystery. This uncertainty is one of the biggest challenges in studying Betelgeuse. With so many variables at play, the companion star, the gas clouds, and the hot bubble, astronomers can only speculate about when Betelgeuse will explode. Predicting the supernova's exact timing is nearly impossible, and the unpredictability of the star's behavior has pushed scientists to develop new technologies to monitor it. The challenge of observing Betelgeuse from Earth is further compounded by its immense distance, around 640 light-years away, making it difficult to study with the precision that astronomers would like. Despite these challenges, the potential breakthroughs that could come from studying Betelgeuse are significant. As researchers continue to refine their observation techniques, they may unlock new insights into the behavior of dying stars and the processes that lead to supernovae. For example, developing more advanced space telescopes that can capture detailed images and data from distant stars will enable astronomers to monitor Betelgeuse and other similar stars more accurately. These tools could open up new possibilities for understanding the evolution of massive stars, and they may even improve our ability to predict when other stars are nearing the end of their life cycle. The mystery surrounding Betelgeuse is not just about predicting when it will go supernova, it's about the fundamental questions it raises about the life cycles of stars. How do stars like Betelgeuse evolve and what causes their sudden collapse? Could Betelgeuse's supernova reveal new phenomena that challenge our understanding of stellar evolution? As the research continues, new discoveries are being made, but these discoveries also raise new questions. For example, if Betelgeuse's supernova is imminent, what could it tell us about other massive stars that are even farther away? What could the radiation and shock waves from Betelgeuse's explosion teach us about the effects of supernovae on nearby star systems, including our own? If Betelgeuse were to explode sooner than expected, the effects would be spectacular. While the explosion wouldn't directly affect Earth, it would likely be visible in the sky, perhaps even during the day. The radiation released could potentially affect satellite communications and GPS systems, as cosmic rays would interact with the Earth's atmosphere. While the explosion itself would not pose a direct threat to life on Earth, it would provide astronomers with an unprecedented opportunity to study a supernova in real time. The data gathered could provide critical insights into how stars die, how elements are created, and how the process of star formation continues across the universe. So, what happens if Betelgeuse explodes unexpectedly? How will it change our understanding of the universe, and could it lead to discoveries that reshape our theories of stellar life cycles? With each new discovery, we get closer to understanding the fate of this enigmatic star and the cosmic mystery that lies beyond it. The next few years could bring answers that change everything we thought we knew about stars, their deaths, and the forces that shape our universe. Will Betelgeuse surprise us before we expect it? Only time will tell, but one thing is certain. When Betelgeuse finally does go supernova, it will be a defining moment in the study of astrophysics. As astronomers continue their research, we may see the development of new technologies that could allow us to monitor Betelgeuse more closely, potentially leading to even more groundbreaking discoveries. Whether Betelgeuse explodes in our lifetime or remains a distant burning mystery, its eventual supernova promises to be a major event in our understanding of the cosmos. Keep watching as we explore the countdown to Betelgeuse's explosive death and stay tuned for more updates on the mysteries of the universe that continue to unfold before us.